Hello everyone and welcome to Gilbro's Gaming Channel. I am the dude and we are playing Frostpunk. Alright guys. Well. Our food's going up slightly. We've got less than a day's worth of food though. Ew. Not good. Okay, so did we get the... The cookhouse is closed at this time of day. Let's have a look what we got. Did we get the hot house? Or were we getting the hot house? Let's have a look at the key what we were searching. No. Hot house. There. Definitely need one of these. A few hardy crops can be grown here, supplying up to 30 raw food a day. Do we have any steam cores? We've got no steam cores. How do we get steam cores? We've got no wood or steam cores. I can't remember how... I think you get them from finding them on scouting missions, which is why we're now progressing our scouting. Researching it. Okay. Let's get on to the next day, and we'll see what we can do. Oh... Every time I come into this game, I just look at it and think, wow. It's, it just looks so nice. And on the load up, it actually gave us some more information about all the different nations of the world have done similar sort of things, building generators up in the north. So there is very possibly a lot more of these cities. I thought it was the last city on Earth, or potentially. I mean, it potentially is. However... It would seem unlikely if every nation has done the sim similar thing. There's probably more than one of from our country, which is the British Empire. So that's how Frostpunk 2 is going to come about then. And we'll probably have rival forces to contend with, which I can't wait. Especially if the game is going to look better than this. I mean, this looks great. To look better than this will be insane. We need more food. Do we have anyone <laughs> gathering wood? Well, we will have. People are going to work. Go to work! itself again. Weird. <clears throat> so we need some more of these little generators. I think around the same sort of level that we're doing it now would be useful. And once we've got the scout missions, we can actually go out and find people that were lost on the way. Our hunters are coming back. Fantastic. Hello. Bring back some food. <clears throat> Researched beacon. Fantastic. Can we get one in? 20 wood, 35 steel. Maybe I'll do one in just a moment. There we go. So now we can send this out. We need this. We need this so badly. What is this building? I have no memory of this place. Right, let's build a little road to it. I got no wood. That's why. Never mind. Let's research something. So, a medical post upgrade. A bunkhouse for more people. Might be useful. At the moment, we're not too fussed about it. Coal thumper, faster gathering, charcoal, sawmill. Sawmill's going to be useful because it lets us get those frozen trees and we're running out of crates. So, can we get this? We don't have enough wood to start researching that. These are the last of the crates. So, yeah, I think that's probably the best way to go. Coal pile has been depleted. Oh, no. Not good. Uh... 
workers out over there then. <coughs> Need to keep that coal coming in. Push. Research the sawmill, please. There we go. Yeah, what's this building? Oh, we have got a hot house. Let's fill it up then. Why did I not even see this? So, hope and discontent is something that's trying to teach us. Hope and discontent levels are crucial for the social stability of the city. There are many factors that can affect them. The most important are people's needs. When they are not fulfilled, discontent rises. Laws. Each law affects the mood of your society. So read the description of each law before you sign it. Buildings. By building certain facilities, you can raise hope and lower discontent. Abilities. There are many abilities in the game that can affect hope and discontent. Hope and discontent also change due to random events and the death of your people. Okay. Thanks for that. Kind of what I figured, but we'll go with it. So we're building the big we're building the beacon and then we shall find survivors out in the world it's going to be absolutely fantastic beacon build we're no longer lost and blind from now on our people will be able to survey the icy barrens that surrounds us what's land oh are we going to get to have a look outside the hole oh this is cool Is it just attached to... It's not going anywhere. We're just going to have a look out of the hole. Oh! Okay! There are... There's a world out here. Woo! Lost expedition. Send scouts to learn about this place. How do I send scouts? Numerous tents. We can see people moving about. They must be lost members of our expedition. Okay. Well, how, how do we do that? Go directly to the beacon to deploy a new unit. Is that what we do? Just having a little looky looky boops. Uh huh. Scouts. We need to create them. We need resources. They are expensive. 40 wood. I suppose they've got to survive out there. Oh well. Right, let's uh, I like how that's just going to stay there. It's going to be really cool. Really cool. Alright, we'll get some wood together. Go on, peeps. What's the problem? People cheer as a giant observation balloon soars above the city. This is a real feat. Everyone feels proud of the work they've done to make it happen. Volunteers have lined up, eager to go looking for our lost people in Frostland. The woman who came forward earlier is among them. We needed a win. Oh, good. Good, good, good. They are very happy enough now. Although the food situation is never as good, but we must improve that dramatically. There must be some research we can do to um, increase our food. Well, if we can... What's this costing us? 75 wood? And we get hothouse insulation, hunting tactics, flying hunters. That sounds mint. This is where it's going to get cool. Get right down to the bottom. What we got? Hot house selection, healthcare insulation, house insulation. So we can really start improving people's lives when we get down there. But let's get the sawmill done. We could do steel works, a wall drill. What's this do? Allows us to build wall drills. Drills into the walls of our crater, uncovering trees that once formed a forest before the ice engulfed them. Provides up to 160 wood per stand work day. That is really good. It takes a steam core though. We haven't got any of those. Yeah. Charcoal kiln is going to be interesting once we get the. I think we get the wall drill first. Sawmill upgrade. 
coal mining, definitely going to be good. Coal thumper. Pumping pressurized water into the underground coal deposits, the coal thumper washes the precious resource to the surface, forming a pile of up to 560 coal per standard workday. That's amazing. Why would you... Underground deposits. Okay, so this does the... Underground deposits as well. And that's better. Is there a cost to it or something? Maybe. Maybe it takes power or... Hmm. Oh, awesome. There's some cool stuff to come. Our hunters have come back. Go pop the food away and our cooks will separate it for everyone. Make the most of it. is gone. Right, let's save all the wood we have. There's no other crates, is there? What's that up there? Nothing. Cogs. No, so we've got to save every little piece of wood we've got until we've got this research done. Workday's finished. Right, let's boost the speed and get us to the next working day. Go on, hunters are going back out again. This is not good. Our food's going to drop. Look at that. Oh, we, we don't even have a day's worth of food. One of our people died. Did it? Eh. Two people died. What are they dying of? Wait, slow the game down. Okay. Lack of treatment. Oh. I thought we signed the thing for the radical treatment. I suppose it's still not good enough for some people. Mm. Yeah, look, we've got a lot of people sick. 16 gravely sick. We need, we need the infirmary. This is a real juggling act to try and get the things that my people need the most. The workday should be starting in a sec. More people dying? Yeah. We lost an engineer, man. Hope is dropping. Five being treated. Is that because there's any room for five in here? Patience. Five out of five. Yes. So in order to improve this, we should build more medical posts. Correct? Correct. We were going to save all the wood, but we just... We just spent it. What are we doing? What are we doing? Okay. Well, well, our people are dying. We can't lose people, because people are power. They are the most important resource to us in this whole game. So we must save them. Hunters are coming home. They've, well, they'll give you the meat as soon as they enter the area, I guess. Awesome. People are dying. Come on, build this up. We need to get some scouts. Maybe I should have built another hunting home as well. Or hunter's lodge. That's something I could have done. 20 wood though. Wood's an issue. I've got five wood. And I'm sure once we've researched this sawmill, it's gonna cost us more than five wood, right? Right, food and health. I 
interesting. We have no resources to do this. Right. Let's go for resources straight away. Sawmill costs 10 wood. Oh. Is there anything left? There's nothing left for you. Can we dismantle this? Yes. And that will give us enough for the sawmill. Wonderful. Right, we've got this. Is this up and working? Inoperative. Uh, got no one available to actually work here. Not at the moment. Who will have? Oh, yes, we will. Sawmill. Amazing. Get a little bit of road done. Road. I ain't got enough resources. Do I have to have a road? I don't think we do. I think we'll manage without one. Some workers in this infirmary. We got no one. Right, cemetery. Child's plea, Captain. We found a boy frozen to the bone in the cemetery next to a fresh grave. He must have been there for hours. He wants you to call an emergency meeting. He says that if you agree, his mother will wake up to attend it. I'm sorry, there's nothing I can actually do. It would be false hope anyway. I am sorry. I've got no people to actually work anywhere. Where are the children? Get the children out here to work. We'll get the maximum one there. We need the maximum amount of people to work in here. Are you guys going to go and build that building? Please? Pretty please! So... Why haven't I got any workers? I just took everyone off there. they got to go back to... Minus one? Let's just open this up. Does this allow for five? I guess so. We can have one nurse in there. Looking after five people. It's kind of like real life where you have one dealing with too many. Okay, let's get that built. We can start getting some wood. You help the sick. They and their families are grateful. Look, I tried, okay. I am glad. Glad you're happy can't really do any more research at the moment. It's going to cost us way too much wood, which we just don't have. Although that allows us to introduce workplace improvements that will raise the efficiency of all sawmills and steam sawmills by 25%. And that does not take wood to research. Interesting. Hmm. What about exploration? More scouts? Yeah, well, we can't afford the first lot. Okay, as it's the only upgrade available to me that doesn't cost wood, we're going to go with it. Having upgrades is probably a good thing anyway. How much more time we got? No adjacent, not adjacent to a street. That sucks, but it doesn't seem to need to be. And it will be one day. 
I promise. So build that road out there. Then we can start adding. We'll get it there. We're out of wood. Yeah, I know. Speed the game. Ho! Oh, why'd you slow me back down again? Oh, because we've got some. Urgent need for treatment. Again? Our people have gathered to protest. The number of untreated sick keeps rising, but you seem to ignore the problem. They demand that you take action. Oh. What can we do? Two days to build one when we haven't got any wood. I'll try. If we can get this working, we'll get the wood to do it. Can we work? Can, how do we trigger the, the emergency shifts? I want you to work more. <laughs> Working hours. Change the shift length. Go. Long shift. Work, work, work. We need that done. Got promises to keep. What does this little button do? That's just my patience to keep thinking about it. It's like it wants me to touch it. Stop. Please get this done, guys. Yes, thank you. We're gonna have to make it work, work, work. Work, 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 work. Okay. This is 24 hour working, so that's good. We need more people working here, though. Would be a bonus. We've got a temperature drop coming up. Oh, no. That's going to lower some hope and increase some discontent, isn't it? Brilliant. Okay. Right, this is working. Good stuff. Maximum workers. Inoperative. Needs to be connected to a street. <laughs> no! is an issue man oh, we can't. we've got nothing to do here can't I build it out of something else now we just dig one out okay let's have a little peek Can't really make do without any homes, can I? We get eight wood back. Inhabitants six out of ten. We could get rid of that one. Yeah, these are. There's no one in them. Get some wood back on these. People are dying, so we've got more homes freed up. <laughs> Silver linings. Well, we've got people there. No one in that one. We get all the wood back we can. We might be able to build the infirmary or the medical post sooner, but we'll build the pathway first. So get it done, guys. Get it done. Let's speed through tonight. Right, there we go. We have 
enough for a path. Is it because of that in the way? Brilliant. Um, get rid of the dismantle or dismantle this. There we go. Lead that up there. Get there, guys. Get that wood done. Uh, we're going to build a medical post. Food, health. As soon as we get 25 wood. People are dying all over the place. No! Hope is dwindling. Temperature falls. We have not got enough coal to really keep pushing this, you know. Max out the coal production gathering, shall I say. Work time. Get back to work. Excellent. Get that going. There we go. We actually have enough for an outpost now. What? Let's build one of these. There's one there. Be good if I could get one around here, but it's too cold. Put one in there. Go for it. I mean, why not? Sweet. Alright, yeah, we've got long shifts going at the moment. Six in the morning till eight at night, rather than eight in the morning till six at night. It's the same short shift, isn't it? Da -da -da. Waiting for workers. Do we have any workers? Oh man. Take them out of there. Take all the workers out of there. Let the kids gather the coal. We must survive. We must. It's too. It's an operative. It's too cold. Need raw food in there. Just keep an eye on things because when they get super cold. Since we can't use them, we'll turn the heating on. It's going to cost us more coal, though. We're going to have to get that coal thumper. A little squeak as it goes round. It's producing plenty of wood, though. Fantastic. Right, research done. Can we get the coal thumper researched, please? Sawmill upgrade is done. Beautiful. There's the emergency shift. But we'll have that little mission done. So hopefully that will raise a bit of hope and a little bit less discontent once that's finished. But I'm going to have to reduce how many people are here. Put them into coal. We are going to suffer. We can't get through tonight with that amount of coal. Especially not with this temperature drop. Oh god. Emergency shift. Everyone. Matter of life or death. This need building. Come on, build this up, guys. 
past it. I'll run out of time. 23 hours left. We should be able to do it. What was that noise? Right. Can we get one? Scouting. Woo! We're sending the scout out. How cool is that? Now we're talking. Finish this. Yep. Alright, let's take a nurse out of here. Put it into here. Is that going to complete? Open a new medical post. Done. It's got to be engineers. Okay. Anyone else that's spare? One person. Put them in here. Emergency shift. Go. Oh, I'm so sorry. This is rising discontent. It's more about surviving, guys. Please understand must be done. Do you reckon this is our scout? Going on expedition, yep. the coal pump of research soon enough and then that should ease us up a little bit we're obviously still going to gather this up but it's going to help hopefully they find some steam cores while they're out there we've got no food to even cook. This is going alright. Well, six out of ten people working here, it's not enough. Oh man, do this. We need food. Got to juggle it. What happened? Yeah, ten out of ten. Get those extra shifts going. Oh Survive, people, survive. Bringing in raw food. To work. Yep, help the sick and happy. You are welcome. There we go, we're making food. Well done. Scouts have reached. Whoa, okay. The beacon gives you access to the world outside the city. You can explore it with scouts deployed through the beacon panel. Scouts are self-sufficient and can venture into great, can venture great distances from the city. They may find precious resources, survivors, and perhaps shed light on the world and its fate. The progress of your scouts is shown through the icons in the upper right corner. Okay. Got it. They're waiting. 
what are we waiting for? Explore. We enter the camp, appearing out of the driving snow, and a choir of excited voices welcomes us. Thank God you found us. We had been wandering for days until we couldn't go on any longer. Soon we'd begin to starve. Children and adults surrounded us, packed and ready to go. do that bring them home safely the remains of an encampment read the journal view the scouts report we entered the camp period oh no that's exactly what we just read that's fine thank you bring them home hello death of overwork end emergency shifts for today what all of them dying because I'm overworking them now. No. Okay. Coal pile depleted. Oh no. Food to keep coming in as well. Yeah, bring them people home. We need them to to live here and work. People probably going to need some more housing as well, right? Build up some. We've only got two people working in here because <laughs> cold is like massive priority. Coal pumper research done. Fantastic. We ain't got no. No wood to do anything else. Okay. Can we get a coal pumper then? Resources. 15 wood, that is. Okay. We need that. I'll boost that up. Get some more wood in. It's costing us coal to do this though. Return safely. 22 workers, 9 engineers, 4 children. Fantastic. Hey, hey! Don't just jump in. Be careful. People from our convoy, reunions. It's heartwarming to see families reunited after so many hardships. But shouldn't there be other settlements nearby? The first expeditions left London long ago. They ought to be well established by now. They'll surely help us find our footing. We will look for others. Discontent is horrible at the moment. So we've got a bunch of workers. Can we get... Hello. Found a trail leading to into the wilderness. We should follow it. We must find other people and ask them for help to secure our survival. Let's use the engineers we do have. Excellent. Need engineers in there, but we don't have any spare. Let's max this out with workers. Max that out with children. <laughs> do we need more homes? Yeah, we do. Cold at home. Bad health care. We can't afford to heat you. 
Oh. Four times emergency shifts. Stop them. Sorry, we can't heat your homes. Oh. Hungry? Go get something to eat. There is some food left. Coal is a big old problem right now. We have to turn the heating off. Oh, it's inoperative. No, we can't. Then. Well, it's closed. Turn it off. Okay, that's functioning. It needs to, it needs to have the heating on. Especially because it's further out, right? Is that why? Yeah. Hunter's going back out again for food. Let's have a look on the map. So we've got our scouts waiting. Sturdy shelter, observatory, crash site. It's telling us to sort of go here, I think. Uh, go there then. Might as well keep you going out. Hope and discontent is terrible. Let's look at the laws. I'm pretty sure we can sanction some fighting. Sign. Let's get the fighting arena. A new law has passed. Need 15 wood. But we also need 15 wood for the technology. Not technology, the coal thumper. But discontent is terrible. I might be able to. How much is left here? Yeah, we might be able to manage until we can get some more wood through. Although coal is, it's just going to run out. We are going to be cutting it close here. What are people dying of? Lack of treatment still. I've got to force you to be miserable some more. We have to keep this working. Can't do it. What are we meant to do? Oh no, coal's gonna run out. Then we're gonna get seriously cold. The generator is shutting down. No. <laughs> Go. Fire up with something else. Uh. Force them to work. Oh, look at the discontent levels. Oh. Coal thumper. Does it need to be on here? It looks like you can just go anywhere. Pop it in there. Build this as fast as possible. Get my engineers out of here. Go build that. Ah! It is shutting down. We 
are not going to make it. Yeah, I know. Consumption's ridiculous. Turn them off. Buy me some time, maybe. So we have to do something before it's too late. You have to build this. Ah. Maximum workforce. <laughs> Gonna fire it up. We are getting we're just burning through coal. Come on, power up. go. We are back, baby. Let's use some consumption. Turn back on the hubs. Let's get that provided for. Oh, man. Let's get this discontent down. Let's make somewhere to fight. is not shutting down. You are not. Steam level one. Shutting down. Oh my god. So many. Build the fight club. Power it back up. Come on. Get it running. Perfect. Hope rises. Discontent falls. Good stuff. No one is fighting. Opens at seven. Okay. Why not? Generator is shutting down again. We need another coal thumper. It's the only way.
to have two. It's probably where the coal mines are actually better in some respects, I guess. Generator is powering down. God, my nose is itchy. <laughs> it's okay. Come on, coal thumper. Oh, you want to teach me about it? There are two types of buildings with area effects. Some buildings like sawmill have an area where resources can be gathered and others area which they can affect people. Right. Exploration. Yep. And the coal fucker. Placement area. Wash coal from cracks in the rock to the surface. You could order people to gather coal from the piles directly or employ them to gathering posts. Wash to the surface. So this is going to make more piles appear, is it? Okay. Okay, that, that wasn't that clear. Gotcha. People need to gather this stuff then, didn't they? That's what you're saying. So it's making piles here, and people need to gather it. Okay. Let's heat all homes. What homes are not heated? Wait a moment. Oh, it's these ones, because this is turned off. That will help. Get that boosted. There we go. Keep that going. Zero hours left. <laughs> Ain't gonna last. No. No. What are you waiting for? It's more. Take the resources. Go there. People are desperate. Final warning. So people are talking openly about overthrowing you. Bereft of hope. They see no future for our city and they blame you for that. What should we do? We must hold on for a couple more days. Ah! Because we've got, like, no food. What? Food for overtime work. Oh. Can't afford it. I'm so sorry. We can't. There's no hope left. Is everyone having a fight? Good stuff. Oh man, yeah. We've got no coal. Oh, we've got plenty of wood. I'm shutting this down. No one here. I want this maximized. Pull that coal. And pull it now. Discontent is going to rise. How long we got left until this is too cold? Oh well. Go for it. Uh oh. 
To save this patient slowly, we have to perform an amputation. As a result, this person won't be able to work. Consider signing the care house or prosthetics, prosthetics law. We can't do it yet. Okay. We signed the fighting law, so we can't do another law at the moment. Speed up. I want everyone gathering coal. Let's turn this on. People need to live. Coal is here. There's a lot of coal here. We didn't even need this. Alright, let's um let's dismantle this building. It's a waste of time. I think we'll be alright with just the one for now. We need to figure out a way of getting hope to people. Cookhouse, he's still working here. Good. Let's maximize this, get as much raw in. Food is not good. Can we build another hunting lodge? Yes, yes we can. Definitely a good option. Um, let's pop one in over here. It's attached to a road on that corner there, so that'll do. Got enough wood, so we ain't gonna worry about that. on everyone to work to work make sure we get all the coal we can we've got these guys making it excellent we must keep this generator going holy moly all right guys i am gonna leave that episode here thank you all very much for watching Whoa. I really hope you're enjoying it. If you are, please do drop a like on the videos and subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more daily content. And until the next one, guys, please do take care of yourselves. The dude is on.